You've probably heard it, Blazor sucks, it is slow, nobody uses it, and it's just another Microsoft experiment, right? But hold on, I'm Patrick God, yes, God really is my last name, and I've been doing web development for over 15 years now, and I've used Blazor to build internal business applications, a blog, landing pages, a time tracker, and even a mini course platform. So. Yeah, I've seen what Blazor can do, but I still hear people say it sucks, it's slow, confusing, and so on, right? Well, I'm here to tell you they are wrong. In fact, I think Blazor is even the future of web development. All right, let's be fair. Some things used to be true. Blazor WebAssembly, for instance, was slow to load. You had to choose between server side and client side. There weren't many tools or templates, so yeah, I get why people said Blazor was not ready. But today things look very different. Since .NET 8, Blazor got a huge upgrade, the render modes. Now you can decide how each part of your application runs, server-side WebAssembly, or the big one, static server-side rendering, SSR, and everything in one single project. So let's talk about that. Static server-side rendering means that Blazor can now build super fast pages, just like plain HTML. No waiting anymore. Just open the page and boom, it is here. You can use it for blocks, for landing pages, for dashboards, for most websites or web applications, actually, this is all you need. And you can still add interactivity later. And here's the best part. You don't have to pick just one mode up front. You can build parts of your app with static pages and others with interactive Blazor components. It is flexible, it is clean, and it's way better than before. Blazor is no longer just that C-sharp thing for the browser. It is now a serious tool for building web applications. Fast, modern, full-stack applications. And if you already know C-sharp, you are way ahead. You don't have to mess with JavaScript frameworks or learn a bunch of new tools. In fact, if you've already built a web API with .NET, for instance, you are ready. You already know the back end, and with Blazor, you can now build the front end too, using the same language. And get this, you can even reuse the exact same code, like your DTOs, use them on the front end. Your validation logic, share it between client and server. No copy pasting, no duplicate code in C Sharp and TypeScript, just clean shared C Sharp code across the whole application. You just write C Sharp and build. So does Blazor suck? Nope, not anymore. It is finally catching up and in some ways even leading. Now, what do you think? Is Blazor ready for the real world? Drop a comment below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. And if you want to really learn Blazor and .NET together with clean architecture, for instance, check out the .NET Web Academy. Link as always in the video description below. Thank you very much for watching. I hope I see you next time. Take care.